DeFi is extremely interesting because we're changing traditional finance and capital markets as we know into a very decentralized system, a very decentralized mechanism. And what does this mean? This means that a lot of the systems that we have in place are going to be automated or going to be improved by removing intermediaries. And we can do this a lot with smart contracts, with mathematics, taking principles from physics, from engineering. There are a lot of ways we can improve the existing system with automation, smart contracts. And in the second part of the book, we're going to dive a lot deeper into understanding DeFi. And you can expect the general economics of DeFi and then understanding the mechanisms for all these different protocols. So it could be automated market maker, it could be lending and borrowing, it could be insurance. There are a lot of other mechanisms out there, very specific mechanisms for different sectors. And I would say that DeFi is still growing. Everything is still in experimentation. If we're talking about derivatives or we're talking about spot rates or we're talking about peer-to-peer -peer or um, protocol or spot rate to derivatives, there are a lot of ways we can explore DeFi. And everything that's in the book gives you a very general understanding, general mechanisms to do to understand what the space is about, to understand all these different systems that are in place. Is this the be all and all? Of course not, because we're continuously exploring, we're continuously experimenting. And once you have these foundations, it's very easy to start exploring better ways to improve the system. One of the problems that we have in the crypto space is that everyone is just forking the, hard, the smart contract. So you're just taking whatever that is out there, you're just copy pasting the code and then build it for your ecosystem. While that is good, that is not the core idea of what open source is, right? Open source is where you have all the systems out there, you have to learn and understand how to use the system, then figure out ways to improve that. So the second part of the book is really to teach you how to, how to make sense of all these smart contracts, all these code, and how to use these mechanisms so that you can improve upon them and use them in new kind of protocols and new kind of tools. And that is absolutely where it's super fascinating. There are a lot of case studies as well, so it helps you to understand what these different case studies are doing and trying to apply all these different mechanisms to the case study. So go on to the link and you can pre-order the book. The book is coming out on Sunday. And after that, we're going to have 12 days of Christmas giveaway. So stay tuned.